What's up mga monsters and we are here again on yet another episode of Johnny Eats. Roll that intro. Alright guys, Johnny here with the latest tips and cheapest tours on how you too can wander on the budget. In the past few months, I've already been in Samduk Salamat and I will not deny it's my favorite Samduk Sal place in town. But this episode is not about Samduk Salamat. We are here to talk about UKB here in BF Homes, Paranaque. Unlike your typical Samduk Sal place, this place is only for 199 pesos for unlimited pork and 299 pesos for unlimited pork and beef and that's already more than half that what you have to pay for than your typical samgyupso plate well if you're not from Paranaque or anywhere south don't worry they still have a couple of branches that is already fully functional and i will flash that on screen right now if you want to know more about this place and also the exact location of their branches you can check their facebook page now let's see if this place is worth the buck Guys, as you can see, the weather is really perfect for today's uh, vlog. Uh, we'll be cooking a lot of meat and it's really hot, especially when we're grilling. But since it's raining outside, it's just the perfect time to do this. So today I will be showing you their menu. As you can see on the screen, they have unlimited pork for 199 and unlimited pork and beef for 299 And yeah, check it out. So guys, binawi nila yung price sa pagiging self-service ng lugar and also this place is not air-conditioned. So I suggest kung visit kayo sa place na to, huwag yung sobrang init na panahon. So guys, we have our cook here, oatmeal again. Ito so yung talagang lagi natin kasama pag yung go-vlog. And also, yung flash ko sa inyo, <laughs> well, si dear na always camera shy. Again guys, they have a wide variety of meat and I will not go in depth with what which is which because there are meat that have names that I cannot even pronounce. They're all jugule, they're all sarangi, I don't know. So guys, yung dito, it's not really just limited to Korean barbecue. They also have all sorts of things like shomai, um, I don't know, fish ball siguro to, or uh, they have dim sum. They even have shopao, look. And they have few varieties of rice. Meron silang just steamed rice, merong kimchi rice. Uh, what Neil will teach us how to eat uh, some gypsum like a pro. <laughs> <laughs> guys, how are you? Pala siya so, I will teach you guys how to eat some gypsum like a pro, okay? side dishes and also meat to choose from compared to other Samgyup Sal place. When it comes to taste, parang same same lang. Though meron sa akong favorite sa Samgyup Salamat na hindi ko maalala yung pangalan. But still, may laban siya for all in 199, di ba? 
Compared to some group salamat, wala silang limited ice tea, they only have soft drinks and also water. Sa water, yung notice ko lang guys na, I don't know if you can see it, but may mga oil residue pa sa baso. This is what some group salamat doesn't have. The kimchi rice. I'll try it. It's my first time trying kimchi rice. So let's see if it's actually any good. Like it's already spoiled. I mean, yung galing pa kagabi. We just finished eating, guys, and now let's move to the, the comprehensive review of the entire experience. First, customer service. At the reception, uh, the person in charge there were able to provide all the information required for us to eat here, including the leftover rule, which you will have to pay extra if you have any leftovers on your table. Don't waste food, guys. All in all, you won't really receive that much of customer service since it's a self-service restaurant. Still, I will say I will give it 9 over 10. Second is the place. It's an open area and there's a lot of cars going in and out of the adjacent village. Right now, we are comfy given that it's raining, but I don't think it will be this comfortable when it is sunny or on a sunny day. So I will give the place about 7 over 10. Lastly, the food. The food is comparable to the other restos offering the same deal. Comparable, but they're not quite there yet. They don't have unlimited cheese though, which is a must for me. Ask my son when he likes the cheese gen. All of its downsides are justified by its affordable price. Imagine 199 pesos and you will get unlimited samgyupsal. And that is it for today's episode guys. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. If not, well, next time pa. Mas ayusin pa, I will continue to make these vlogs better. Again, I would love to hear from you guys. If you have any comments, suggestions, recommendations, please comment down below. By the way, dito kami ngayon sa Dakasi, and I will make a whole different review of this place really soon. Alright? Peace! So we're here guys with another episode of John You Wonders! <laughs> so I'm right here at our house, and super mess so I'm trying to vlog for it myself okay cut